hey, so I actually filmed this on Sunday because I won't be in town Tuesday because it's a national holiday, Queen's Day, where we celebrate the birthday of not the Queen we have now, but the previous one, whatever. We're actually getting a new monarch. Our Queen stepped down and we are now getting a king. So apparently that's exciting to some people. I really, I mean, cool, whatever. So I will be going to my friend in another city and we're just gonna celebrate whatever. Wait, hold on a second. I think this is a bit too scruffy for the last day of Ada. Let's change into something a little more suitable. Wink. That is much better. Tuxedo Tuesday, also known as I still like alliteration a little bit too much. I thought today as the last day of Ada, it would be nice to look back at the whole experience. I started Veda with the idea of, hey, I want to go back to making videos, what's a good time to start? And then I thought, Veda would be good because it's 30 days and you make a video every day. It gets you back into the routine of making things and it was a lot of fun. I met some great people that I wouldn't probably have met otherwise. I say meet. Uh, I guess that counts on the internet, right? I made some stuff that I wouldn't have made if I didn't start Veda in the first place. It has been a, a lot of hard work, sometimes a lot more than I'd initially expected and sometimes I could be done in half an hour, which is kind of amazing to me, seeing as uh, something like this, even the preparation for this, like tying this bow tie, tied it myself, because you're not gonna put on a clip-on bow tie. That's that's not cool. Bow ties are too cool for that. Uh, you can probably tell that I did it myself because it's kind of wonky, but this took me 45 minutes. I was thinking maybe I'd do a tutorial on how to do these, but I wouldn't be the best person to go about doing that. So yeah, but Fade, I gave me a lot of experiences that I wouldn't have otherwise had. So it was tough at times to come up with what to do and then to do it in however short amount of time that you had, but I liked it a lot and I would definitely want to do it again sometime next year. If I have the time, absolutely. So now that Veda is over, I won't be making videos every day. Uh, I want to make a schedule maybe because then I'll stick to it because otherwise if I don't have a video idea and nothing will come of it. Veda forced me to think of video ideas where I just sat down for however long, maybe I shouldn't say, and just thought of what what kind of stuff could I do, what can I talk about, what kind of a strange video can I make or a skit or something like that. And I, I mean I have a file full of video ideas, a lot of which I will probably never do because looking back they're not good ideas, but still. and. Veda forced me to do that, but outside of Veda, I sort of have to rely on ideas to just sort of appear. So if I have a schedule, then I have to come up with things on a regular basis and that will be better. So maybe I'll do a schedule. It'll, it's probably for the best. I'm thinking at least once a week, at least once a week. So could be more. Veda has definitely made me look at this whole video making in a different way because uh, even though I had to make videos every day, there's some videos that I actually spend a lot of time making. I mean, they took up the entire day. My Silence Will Fall video took me, in total, everything I went through, uh, took me about nine hours. So I wasn't expecting that, but I had a lot of fun making it. And I didn't actually think that uh, every step of the process to me would be so much fun and it was so interesting to try all these new different things where instead of just me talking to the camera what I used to do I'd actually write entire scripts out and act if you can call it that and just do all these sort of new things and these are I wouldn't probably have tried these if it wasn't for Veda so I'm really really happy that I did this I absolutely loved it I'm gonna miss it, but at the same time I'm gonna be happy that it's over because it was a lot of hard work, although it was so much fun. And I'll see you guys next time, which will be soon. A pint of dirt, yes, it had better be. Oh, oh, I, oh that, that's gonna be such a good pun. Do <laughs>
That's what a tuxedo does to me. 